Hey, Scott from AroostaCobb.com here. And Seth from Mark Woodman's Breakfast Club. Together, the three of us, we are Mark Woodman's Breakfast Club, and we have a fire going in our, our ash bin. Here. Yeah, I, I did that. I got bored. He was writing something, and I got these strips of paper over here taking up space, and so... But, you know, that you know, that's that's where we have, like, we, we dump our dawdle in here. Yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> that's, uh... <laughs> Shouldn't let me get bored. I guess uh, welcome back to Tobacco Advent. It's day 23 in our countdown count up to Christmas. Welcome back, boy. Thank you. Uh, welcome back, Homer. Thank you. Today's oh. cornament is going to be going to William Nunnery, who sent to us three different tobaccos. Sweet. Today we are going to smoke Old Carolina, or perhaps it's Olay. Uh... <laughs> Uh, this is kind of cool because William is uh, in Fayetteville, North Carolina. Where is Fayetteville? I don't know. It's to the east of us, someplace. Is it? Yeah. It I, is. I literally have no idea. It's to the east. It's a couple hours east. Um, it's uh, where one of the forts are based out of. The military installments. I've now said too much. Okay. There we go. Thanks. All Carolina. Nothing. Can't be anything wrong with this. Smells, uh, dare I say, one Q-ish. Smells of sweet tea and moonshine. Barbecue. I wish. All Who right. makes this? Do we know? No. All right. Well, he picked it up from a place called um, Anstead's Tobacco Company, also in Fayetteville. I can't believe how much the table is burning right now. Yeah. I want to do something about that. Become a real fire hazard. All right, William, thank you for sending that mm -hmm. along to us. We appreciate that, and a cornerman is coming your way. Today's question of the day, soon to be burning on the table. Oh, it's a big one. You're walking down the street feeling great. Right. What holiday song would be playing in the background? Hmm. Yeah, I have a couple new, um, a couple new holiday songs I've been enjoying. Mm -hmm. You know, we we talked a few days ago about the songs that we're just getting sick and tired of. Um, but have you heard Sia's Christmas song? Well, no. actually, she put out several songs. But I want to say it's called Santa is Coming. No. And the other one... Is it an original song? I, uh, being Sia, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. She is prolific. Yeah, she is. And the other one I have really been enjoying is the one from Kelly Clarkston. Um, what is that one called? I don't know. Under the, under Since the, you've been gone? Underneath the Christmas tree. And... Um, Behind these You're hazel, I've got these that. I've got, I've got that in your, your head now. You're welcome for that. <laughs> uh, you know what? I was listening. <laughs> I um, just got back last week from a four-day, 21 hours uh, worth of driving road trip from North Carolina to Florida. Drove all around Florida and came back. And was with a coworker, and we were listening to old uh, 90s and, and early 2000s music and. Um, Kelly Clarkson was one of the one of the artists that we knew in common. Uh, uh, oh. co coworkers ab about uh, she's seven years younger than me, and so you know there's not a lot of crossover. Hey, in music. Avril Lavigne wasn't a big fan, but knew Kelly Clarkson ended up you listening or to. She was not a big fan. She was not. No, I liked Avril. I actually liked Avril. Um, I saw Avril in concert. Yeah. Well, did you? Kinda. Yeah. <laughs> she was outside the Today Show in New York City while I was there, so. Uh, me and a bro worker went to see her in concert. Cool. It's free. Saw a couple yeah. songs. Um, well, so the point of this story is we ended up listening to uh, listening to some Kelly Clarkson, including A Moment Like This, the winning song, the title song. Man, that is really going. I'm telling you, you got a bonfire going. Tell you what, I'll no, 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 no. There's no fire. Look, it's just, it's just smoldering. It's just smoldering. We're fine. We're fine. It's good. I almost got kicked out of college for this. It's fine. This is the tobacco advent version of a cuspidor, uh, a spittoon, if you will. 
I will. And um, when we when we have to get rid of some dottle, it goes into this this bucket. And every now and again, we'll just toss it into the fireplace behind yeah. us or the wood stove. And we don't normally throw lit pieces of paper into it. Yeah. Well, I wonder why. It, you know. You know, you maybe have learned your lesson now. <laughs> if you don't, you know, just putz around and just spend your time. Oh yeah, there's some there's some good stuff. What's your in Christmas here for song, me. boy? Uh, a new Christmas song? What was no, that? No, oh, I don't know. They'll be going jingle bells. Your, be jingle bells in your head. Jingle bells. Jing, jingle bells. You're 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 out lunting at Christmas time. I, lunting, which is I do not smoking a pipe while walking. Some would say it's walking while smoking a pipe, but I prioritize those differently. Yeah, I, I, I prioritize them um, by doing neither, neither if I can help it, or no, no walking if I can help it, but certainly not at the same time smoking a pipe. I have, I have a hard time, hard enough time walking with full oxygen, <laughs> let alone, let alone you know whatever this is adding to the mix. Okay. Um, uh, jingle bells. Uh, Jingle Bells is is mine. Just the go to uh, me. No, it's playing. No, it doesn't. But if, I don't, it's, playing, I, if, if it's music playing, no, in it's, your but head. it's me. Yeah, it, yeah. If it's music playing in my head, it's me singing it. Honestly, I don't know who sings Jingle Bells. I know lots of people have done it. Jingle Bells is my go-to Andy, Christmas Andy song. Williams. Sure. Here we go. It's it's Andy probably Williams. Me. It's the Andy Williams. Probably version. probably my version because it's probably wrong. You probably get some of the lyrics wrong. But when I'm, sometimes, Jingle Bells will be my whistle while I work song. That, that I'll, I'll be singing or humming or whistling even when it's not Christmas time. I used to do that a lot when I was working as a cashier at Target. And, and during the, I only worked there during, uh, three months, uh, and not uh, June, Christmas. July, <laughs> August. <laughs> and, um... Because it was so such an oddball thing, I used to get, I used to get moms who would bring their kids through my line because their kids would remember that I was singing or humming or whatever, and, and their kids would would request it. That uh, was weird. Yeah, but you know, people were like, "Are you? Is that? Is that Jingle Bells? Yes, it is. Well, yes, it is. Yes, it is. So probably that. Um, you stopped smoking old yeah. Carolina. Yeah. While you were dealing with right. the bonfire. Well, you know. Priorities. <laughs> so I, what do you think of it? I got a big cup of smoke? Diet Coke or Coke Zero over here. We could have poured on it, but I also have priorities. What do you think of Old Carolina? It's fine. It's fine. Olay. Yeah. I agree. Thank you, William. Thank you for sending that along. We do appreciate it. Cornament number day number twenty three is uh, coming your way, and uh, the balance of those. Tobaccos we will smoke in the coming weeks of Tobacco Advent. So thank you for, or I'm sorry, coming weeks of Marco Men's Breakfast Club. So thank you for the continuing support. Yeah. All right. Answer the question. Video response gets you in the contest. Comment below. Get you maybe a thumbs up. <laughs> Make it a great day. We will see you again tomorrow for day 24. See ya.